Hello, mini crafters. How are you? I'm Miss Penny. Nice to see everybody again. I feel like it's been so long. We have Penny Bones in the background and we have some little Halloween stuff. Um, let's get started on our craft. We are making five little pumpkins sitting on a fence craft. So we're going to get started. We get to paint today, so make sure that you have on a smock or clothes that are okay to get dirty. So you guys go do that. Maybe your big person will put down something to save the table just in case, and then we'll get started. So you're gonna want um, a paintbrush, maybe two of them, one to paint your hand and one to make some grass later on. Um, if you have some markers, those would be good. Uh, all right, some scissors. Um, scissors, maybe, okay? You might be using them, you might not. Some. A glue stick that would be good and then you'll have the stuff in your kit so you'll have your directions a black piece of paper you'll have these pumpkins if you want to use them and then you'll have the little poem and the paints okay so the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna start painting our hands okay um, let me get one thing because I forgot to get this I am going to get um, some paper towels to wash my hands off with. All right. And I'm back. Okay. I forgot to get this because I'm going to want to wash my hands. Okay. You're going to take the paintbrush and you're going to paint just the top part of your hand. Okay. I'm going to take my rings off because I don't want them to get painted. I always make, I always do that mistake. Okay. You're going to take just the top part of your palm and no to the thumb. Okay. So the top part of your palm and four fingers. We're gonna paint those white, okay? So I'm painting those, I'm painting them. There we go. So just that part, there we go. Okay, so once we have that on there, I am going to Take my hand, I'm gonna open my fingers just a little bit because my hand is gonna be, your hand, is gonna be the fence for your pumpkins, okay? So we're gonna just take your hand and put it right there like that. Make sure that you push, push it tight to make sure all of your handprints get on there, okay? And that's that, that's one. Um, I'm going to use my same hand just because it's easier, but if you guys could use your other hand, that would make this look so much cuter, okay? And because you're going to have a big person helping you, it'll be easier too, okay? But I'm just going to use the same hand, but you guys switch to the other hand and use your other hand and do the same thing, okay? Paint just the top and just the four fingers. Open your hand a little bit. Put it right next to this one to make your fence big and long. Press it down really hard and ta-da, we're finished. Now you have one long white picket fence. Your pumpkins are gonna sit on top of that. Now I'm gonna keep moving along because I'm doing a video, but you guys, um, this would be a good time to let it dry, okay? So let that dry. Now you're gonna decide, do you want to use the pumpkins that I sent home in your kit? Or do you want to use the tips of your fingers to use as pumpkins? If you want to use these, cut them out right now or have your big person help you because they're going to be tricky. If you're going to use your fingers, you're going to take one finger and you're going to whoop, dip it into the orange paint. And then you're going to pick five, just five, because this is the poem, five, five of these fingerprints of the white ones and just Put them on there. One, two, three, four, and five. So I have made five orange polka dots, which are going to be pumpkins. Um, now, I brought a marker over to draw faces, but I can't do that until they're dry. So I won't be able to do the faces yet. So in the meantime, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, this thin, um, I took a little tiny paintbrush. I'm going to take my tape it and dip, in, dip it into the green paint. So I'm, tip, I'm dipping it into the green and I'm going to make some grass down at the bottom of my 
pipes. There we go. There we go. So I'm just putting some grass down here. Again, your guys' this should be dry. It'll work a lot better if it's dry. There we go. Now it's just kind of looking like a fence. There we go. Yeah. Then you want to rinse off your paintbrush here. And I did not um, bring water. You might want to have a little cup of water to rinse it better in. I didn't, so I'm just wiping it as well as I can. Then you can either, either use your finger or the paintbrush. Dip it in the yellow. See the yellow on there? And let's make a little moon up in the, the corner. So I started with the paintbrush. You know what? I'm going to finish with my finger. Oh, I'm dipping my finger. Just one finger. That's all you really need. So I'm going to make a little moon in the corner. There we go. There we go. A big moon, actually. There we go. So there it is. That, that's really, that's it. Okay, when this is dry, you can put little faces on, on the pumpkins, but I can't do it until it's dry. But that is what I have this marker for. Now the glue is for if you cut out these pumpkins, then you're going to put those on the, on the fence posts here, okay? Then we have this, which is the poem, and you want to glue that onto the paper. So we're going to take some glue and put it on here and then just put it right there so now we have our little poem and i forgot a white crayon so i'm gonna go get it but there you have your poem and the five little pumpkins all sitting on the fence now the reason that i had you grab a white crayon now i have it is so that you can also sign your name and because this is black paper um white shows up the best so I am going to put Miss Penny down at the bottom. There we go. So now you signed your name with the white crayon. That's it. Should we do it now? All right, everybody get your fingers up. Just five of them, one hand. Okay. And five little pumpkins sitting on a gate. The last, oh, I'm sorry. Let's try this again. Let's go again. Everybody get your hand up. Five little pumpkins sitting on a gate. The first one said, oh my, it's getting late. The second one said, there are witches in the air. The third one said, but we don't care. The fourth one said, let's run and run and run. The fifth one said, I'm ready for some fun. Then, ooh, went the wind, and out went the light, and the five little pumpkins rolled out of sight. Was that a good one? You guys can do that with your pumpkin thing. You can do it at home with your friends and your family, and it'll be so much fun. You guys have fun doing this. Remember when it's dry, you can put the faces on, but I can't do it because it's still wet. Um, and then you can hang this up somewhere so everybody can see it all the time. And then you can sing the pump or you can say the pumpkin poem all the time. You can just walk around saying five little pumpkins sitting on a gate. And then you can tell everybody what the first one and the second one and the third one and the fourth one and the fifth one said it and then what happens to them whoa that'll be so fun you guys have so much fun say goodbye penny bones goodbye everybody i can't wait to see you again bye everybody